the uh, Kenwood DNX 8120 with my uh, iPhone. Um, I was able to get my iPhone video to uh, actually come out. Uh, so here we go. Uh, here's my um, iPhone. Okay, I'm gonna dock that into my custom made docking station. Okay, so while my unit is booting up, <clears throat> as you can see, it says that this accessory is not made to work with iPhone, but it will show you after that message goes away, it says that the, uh, the accessory is attached. Okay, it's like a little iPod icon. Alright, so here's the tuner. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, go into my iPod. Oops, sorry. Okay, so it says reading. As you can see, uh, I'm gonna go into video. Uh, go into movie. Let's say right now I got this Get Smart exclusive clip from Apple. Okay. There you are. Okay. So as you can see, uh, now that it's coming out of my uh, iPod, uh, yeah, you do once in a while get that static GSM noise, um, but that's part of what you get with uh, working with a phone so close to uh, your device. All right, so what I'm gonna do is uh, go back in, and I'm going to pick another, um, this, this time we'll do a, a music video, Duffy. Again. All right, so there it is. Uh, it's working. Uh, this with the instruction that I posted in the forum, uh, you should be able to get it to work. The only trick is that if you kick the iPhone out of the screen, the iPod accessory attached screen, the video will go away. Uh, so for example right now if I get a phone call, I pick up my phone and then I uh, basically answer it and switch it into another screen and put it back in. It may or may not come back the video. Uh, you just have to make sure it comes back into that screen. So for example right now I'm going to go in here. Uh, let me stop this. Uh, let me actually just stop this first. Um, go back to let's say. Let go back to my tuner again. Okay, all right, so I'm gonna do something here on my phone. Uh, let's say I'm putting into uh, a web browser. All right, so you see my web browser is kicking in. Um, then I'm gonna go back to the source again. Click on iPod. Um, as you can see, the video won't come back, all right? This, the music is there, but it won't come back. So the only way you can get it back is you need to put it back in um, iPod mode again. And um, for some reason, that would uh, kick it back. All right, let me try it again. There it is. That video just came back. All right, so make sure uh, your iPhone uh, will come back to the screen if you want to get the video to work consistently. All right. Well, good luck, guys.